Hey everybody, and welcome to another episode of Moon Ring. It is day three of the Ancient Moon, and we are... Uh, where the hell am I, actually? We're at Bale's Tomb, uh, which I'm not sure what that is. It seems like an incredibly dangerous dungeon. Uh, before I get into it, I might as well just sabotage this trap over here. I got one scrap of ancient metal. What a scam. And we're in. Oh, wow. Ooh, it's revenants in this place. The revenant enemies, we fought with them in the previous episode, which was the live stream episode. And they were definitely a pain in the ass, for sure. They had more HP and I think more damage than the like random enemies I was fighting before. Oof. Hmm. Found a pressure plate. Uh, the pressure plates in this game just unlock like a door. So somewhere on the level, a door has been freed. Maybe it was this door? Be a little bit lame if it was that door. But whatever it is what it is. I see some coffee. My my badger meat has decayed. Oh my god, I'm starving. Excuse me. Uh I guess I'll get eat some of the moldy fruit. It's uh, you know, not the best experience, but it does help solve the hunger. I'm not going to eat the moldy meat. I think I will eat just a ton of raw meat. Oh, the uh, meat gives you torpid. Interesting. Well, unfortunately, I'm just going to have to chow down. Oh, wow, it slowed me for like eight rounds. Okay, we got our black water draft. Huh. This pressure plate unlocked this door. Okay, um, suppose I'll just wait for the undead guys to get closer. <laughs> Not a fan of the- What? The mage came back? Are you serious? Uh, what's the range on my trap ability? Let's see, if it's more than one... No, it is one. I mean, these motherfuckers are not going to be uh, vulnerable to... What do you call it? Poison. Oh no, my poise has been broken. Just going to power jump over here. I need to retreat a little bit to get some poise back. Oh, is it how it works that, uh... It turns into a skeleton mage if... If the flame skull, like, hits a skeleton. Also, we're incredibly low on HP. I'm just gonna consume one of my several large potions of healing. Normally, I would use the vampire ability to regain HP. But unfortunately, revenants have no blood. So, you know. Oh, secret door. Get a lot of unknown devices as well. I should have some identify scrolls, which are called Rosettas. I have three of the motherfuckers. Uh, I guess I'll do a faceted stone. A scrying stone. That lets you uh, see the local area. I kind of don't think I want to use that. It sounds like a big sellable to me, unless it's reusable. A cross of force? Is that a weapon? A metal cross capable of sending a wall of force in one of the cardinal directions. Items such as these were used to construct Sibiroon roads. Oh, like it flattened the fucking ground. Interesting. 
don't think it's gonna tunnel uh, through the wall like in Dungeon Crawl Stone Soup which is fine uh, do I have water? <laughs> oh my god, I was not paying attention. I guess I'll go get some water and some vials. Okay, I can't fill a vial with uh, the lava. Which makes a lot of sense. Probably want to retreat until I'm not vulnerable. Excellence. Uh, I'm just going to apply some more water myself. I've been burned once more. Now come on, fire. Now walk into the fire, you skeleton bastard. Well, I'm going to I'm going to aggro. I'm going to throw this weapon. No, he's waiting. He doesn't want to step into the fire. Dude, this fire is so annoying. Okay, there we go. It was literally lasting like fucking 10 bajillion years. Probably should be sneaking. Huh. If I do the shockwave, I can get like a bunch of damage on these guys. Very cool. I found a chest key. Just gonna push this guy away and retreat. So I can regain some poise. I might as well hurl my weapon at this... Excuse me? That's so BS. Just splashing water on myself because the uh, skeleton guy uh, explodes, but it didn't explode. I mean, being wet is good. Just generally speaking. Got a carved steel key. Can I, like, shockwave over a water gap, by the way? Not 100% sure. I, it wouldn't surprise me if I could not, but it would be pretty badass if I could. We'll find the correct pressure plate. Okay, it's probably one in here. We can vampire bite on a... Uh... Oh, no, wait. The beetles don't have blood. Sag. I mean, the beetles will give us more uh, lightning bolt points. <laughs> oh, what is this? It did 174 damage. Excuse me? Guess I'll hurl my sword at the dude. Okay. Apparently that was a moon specter. Moon specters are real badass motherfuckers. No, I cannot vault over, uh... Oh, wow, that's a very sneaky secret door. Cannot vault over gaps. Uh, is, is like, a mummy gonna come out? No. Oh, badass. It's just free loot in this tomb. Love to see it. Uh, the key should go somewhere. I guess there, the door must be on the left-hand side. Oh, just free Rosetta. Don't mind if I do. Just gonna let this guy walk up to me. Fantastic. I wonder if these guys are pre-aggroed, if I can get a sneak attack on them. Oh, this guy doesn't know what's gonna hit him. Never mind, he fucking ran into me. So if I smack this guy... Oh, it's this fire. This, like, ghost guy that, uh... 
can occupy a corpse. That's really rude. Uh, I'm gonna water myself up. Let's see, the uh, dude has died and given me another Rosetta. Each one of those guys is a thousand gold, which is so actually amazing. Okay, we use the uh, silver key, I think. Oh. God damn it. Uh, that's not good. I want to regain more poise, please. Please, sir. Uh, I'll put a trap down. See, uh, what happens. Oh, it said unharmed. That's so rude. This is kind of awkward. I think I'm gonna... Yeah, retreat a little bit. Oh, no! Okay, thank goodness. That guy was slow as fuck. We can regenerate our poise. We got some oil as well. Which is nice. Wait, what? It's a health gnome. Come back here, my health gnome. Can I do a shockwave and hit the gnome? I can hit the gnome. Oh no, my poise has been broken. Oh no, my poise is super fucking broken. I need to retreat. Hopefully the gnome doesn't disappear. Can this guy get off my ass? Thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate him giving me the extra swing as well. He's giving me a shiny silver key. I sense a new presence in the dungeon. So over time, uh, dudes will spawn into the dungeon. Which, uh, I don't know if it's nice or not nice because... At the end of the day... Do I have water still? I do have water still. That's really... That's really fucked up. I need to find more water soon. Uh, can I get sabotage done? Boom. Oh, I see some water over there. Alright, I will fill some empty bottles. I think having four of them should be good enough. Now we can return down here. Looks like shit is getting Omega fucked. Wait. This dude spit out fire? Uh, that, that's not good. You little fucking coward. I'll hurl my sword at you. What? Okay, I've destroyed him. He did light me on fire in the process. But such is life. Got Arnott's Panacea. What's that guy do? I have two of them. Oh, here it is. Its properties is a cure all. It's distilled from a secret blend of botanicals known only to the highest orders of the sanguine riches. Uh, witches. Okay. Interesting. So that is pretty good. Status effect unenabled. 
I've gotten a locust device fragment. Ah, uh, we needed those for stuff, right? I think I'm gonna unsneak so I have better reaction time against the fire. Is that everything in the dungeon? I mean, there's like a little bit to the top left that we could explore. Be nice to have like a living enemy to slurp on. Nope, there's literally nothing. Did find 30 buccarinos though, so at least there's that. Just gonna wander my way over to the entrance, which um, is up and to the right. Excuse me, the little bastard. Okay, amazing. So in theory, I could go back into this dungeon and just farm it, but I don't really want to do that. This would be too easy. Do I have... I should have Amber Ward Nectar or whatever, right? Amber Bane Ward Oil. Yeah. Uh, whoops. <laughs> it's not paying enough attention. I will do the Bloody Feast and get all my HP back. Now I just need to wait for the ghost to uh, fuck off, basically. Or wait for my poise to return. That ghost is so rude. Its AoE does no damage, but it does break poise. So you have to just kind of like play it super duper slow sometimes. Oh, is this another area of permanent amber? There's supposed to be some sort of area where the amber never moves, which has like a dude. That previous area was one of those zones. I'm very low on oil. I'm not gonna be farming for berries in uh, Amber Hell. I think that'd be pretty ridiculous. What? You little fucker. Oh, what's this place? Stormwood. Oh, it's the Sanguine Ladies Town. You're not of the lady. I can tell. You look swarthy. Look around. We're paler. Rude. I'll have you know I'm the palest motherfucker there ever was. I wonder if your sellsword dies. Does a new one spawn? I don't think I want to go to the hardware store. What do you've got? Jack Queen. Obsessed, that's what they are. It's getting ridiculous. I wish they'd shut up about it. Oh, it's my friend. They kept going on about some place called The Hollows. I told them to shut up about it, and now they're refusing to talk to me or anyone else. They just sit around and sigh. The Hollows. Ha! Just ask them about it. I gave up some time ago. I have no desire to hear anymore. Sometimes you just have to move on, right? Who's your friend? Is Liam your friend? Hail, stranger! Blood is all! Blood is all? And all is blood. By your hesitation, I see you're not familiar with our litany. 
Blood is all is our litany, our greeting, our way of life. You should always greet the handmaiden thus. Our priestess, the title demands a certain formality. It shows respect. Okay, reasonable. Okay, so there's Cleo. I want to go to the Hollows. That sounds like a cool dungeon. Don't really need to talk to the barman. Oh, here's the person. Cora. If you wish to parley with me, you would do well to recite the litany. Uh, sure. Learn it, then return to me. And all is blood. Yes, the words of Our Lady are key to our ways. Can you understand this? Yes, Giga Chad. Our Lady of the Sanguine Moon. Our mother, our sister, our benefactor. Our candle burns in her honor. We owe her our blessings and our ability to thrive on such abundant nourishment. If it bleeds, it can sustain us. We need very little in comparison to those who eat normal foods. Our sisters are sharp of eye and the most wonderful alchemists. All it takes is an empty bottle, a little blood, and herbs found readily in the wilds of Caldera. Uh, candle. The Crimson Candle. It's held safe from the eyes of others deep within the necropolis. The ancient city of the dead. None venture there nowadays. Do you wish to brave its tombs? I'm guessing that's why you are here. Let me show you where it lies. Here, see? I've marked it on the map. But knowing this is not enough. Not enough? Indeed it is not. The entrance has been sealed. <laughs> God damn it. Since the last Archon's Ascension, you'll need to break the seal with the solvent. The potion requires five rare Andera herbs. Come to me with these and I'll make the potion for you, though you're more likely to perish in the endeavor. Indeed, they only grow in magically infused areas at the center of four great stones. You'll see them in the wilds of Caldera if you have... A keen eye. Only grow. And should grow one Indera plant here. At some point, Bo's stolen. Since then, we failed to grow more. Rumors say the thief fled southeast to the mountains. I know not what became of them. Interesting. Oh, they fucking suck on these horses and sheeps. It's highly repulsive. <laughs> Just butcher them and eat their flesh like we do. Like a normal person. The last shipment to Wintershaw was the largest yet. I suppose the forests are quite dangerous. If you keep company with wolves, you're going to bleed. <laughs> okay, is there a dude? Where's the dude who's talking about the place? I want them to mark it on my map. Oh, you know what? There's a little, like, forest clearing. What? Excuse me? I might as well fill a bottle with water. Might as well fill a bottle with water. Where's this person's buddy? What the hell? They like RNG wander wander into like the random some random corner of the map. Oh, here's a corner up here. There's a locked door to someone's house. Oh look at that. Gomer. Sigh. The Hollows. Ask a sign villager about the Hollows. This is the person. I have to capitalize it? You. You know about the Hollows. Everyone else told me I was crazy. To 
finally, it's so good to find someone to talk about it. It's a conspiracy, you know that, right? How else would they keep such a big secret? It all started when, a cre when creatures known as giant slores, that slutty boars uh, in vampire speak, dug away at a mountainside about 50 years ago. I've never seen a slore, but I'm sure they exist, otherwise the entire idea would fall apart. A mountainside? Okay, I see how it is. As promised, a uh, fucking map. I did not receive one. Is there anything I should buy or sell while I'm here? Also, my I got god points. I think I want to get gash because I want the uh, blood. So I'll just attain that. I think it's a very important ability to have. It's like the sabotage ability. Cost 40 points, Sag. Um, don't think any of these weapons are better than what I've currently got. Which B would it be? Do you have any special crazy person armor? Hmm. I kind of want to get a shield. I feel like that would be pretty badass. It would reduce dodge a little bit by 1%, but it would give me 15% block. Yeah, I think I will buy it. Cool, and then sell. Uh, looks like Chin is pretty high price, so I will sell all of it. Scraps of fur are in humongous demand. I will sell all of it. Scraps of hide are in humongous demand. I will sell all of it. I only had one. I want to keep my metal, I think. So I can make, like, robots with them. Where am I getting all these flasks, by the way? Excuse me? Maybe I'm getting one every time I fill up some oil. I could probably sell my old short sword. No, it's got low demand. Not gonna do it. Mmm. Orbit Combustion sells for a pretty good amount. I will sell it. Oh, the Lifestone heals. It says area healing. Does that mean it would heal my fucking buddies too? Or and by my buddies, I mean the enemies. Okay, I guess I'll equip the round shield. I think I've gotten a pretty big upgrade after all. Oh fuck. What's my Amber Ward oil count? <laughs> I think I should go buy some. Uh, who would sell the Amber Bane oil? Is there like a. Yeah, there's an alchemy store. 16 paces to the north. Here it is. I want this oil badly. Let's see. Oh, it's so cheap. I'll buy it all. Thank you very much, good sir. Um, I think I want... Let's say I own three large potions fueling. I think I want a... Uh, I'll get a couple small potions of healing. There's no reason not to have them, right? In fact, I think I'll get a couple more. It uh, is a way to heal without going through the fucking hassle of finding seven bajillion kindlings. Oh, I've got a shield on my sheet now. Or on my dude. That's so badass. Guess I could go... Uh, to the east. Fuck off, merchant. You fucking son of a bitch. What the hell is that guy? 
it's a big fat ogre. Uh, I definitely think I'm gonna just instantaneously like shockwave up. Kill the uh, little dudes. What? Okay, fuck off, ogre. You will not get me so easily. I'm so glad I got stun resistance. Okay, I'm gonna gash them. Blood tainted. Oh my god, I'm so glad he didn't just like one shot me. I feel like I was a little bit greedy with that second smack. You know, these uh, badgers and shit are a pretty good source of lightning points. Because it, it gets recharged every time you smack someone, right? Okay, these are mounds up here. My Amber Bane, Ward Oil. I don't like that the big guy giggled. That's some fucked up shit. Big things should not be giggling. I was very greedy with that last hit. If he dodged and counterattacked, I would have been fucking dead. What's this place? Need Great Key, Temple of the Bow. Okay. That's cool. I think I will look for a berry real quick as well, because I'm starving Marvin right now. Should have bought some berries in town. It is what it is. Excuse me, where is the berry? Oh, there it is. Might as well eat the berries while I'm here. And the hedgehog meat. Okay, there we go. Prey disappeared. I wasn't hunting the prey. Okay. Hmm. I guess the next area we got explorers to the right. It's so badass to get the like freebie smack on uh, the dudes. No. It's not quite fast enough to get the traitor. Or the dough. There's this area down here, I guess. I think I should probably activate my amber amulet thingy. My amber ward. Coolio. Yeah. Oh, this is going to be something badass at the end of this trail. What the hell? Wait, there's a house. Door remains unpassable. We have no way to open it. Excuse me? That is a fuck ton of deeters. I definitely am just gonna flee. And use my last oil. Rot right, weaken to you, reducing the amount of damage you can do. That's not good. I'm now on fire. Think I'll just, uh, run away. Oh, that's the necropolis. Okay. 
God, I hate hate rotting over and over. Just gonna run away once more. There's literally no reason to fight the dudes. You don't get any XP for it. No, I appreciate that this area isn't filled to the brim with amber. Oh, there's some amber cultists, dudes. No. Okay. I'm fine. Yeah, you can heal up all you want. I'm getting my poise back. Bleeding causes initial loss of blood. In addition, you slowly lose health. I got bandages a little while ago. Boom. There we go. Wonderful. The next time I see, like, a... I guess I could just look for a badger right here, right? No. No badgers in sight. Next time I see prey, I'll, uh, just farm them for blood. I think I've made a terrible mistake here. Please let me off this map. No. No. Why is this area surrounded by water? The fuck? Dude, the amber monsters are gonna fucking get me. Dude! What the hell? Okay. Okay, it actually takes a while for you to get ambered. Oh, there we go. The steer is actually mocking me. The joke will be on the deer. I'm gonna like use some fucking superpowers on it. <laughs> Excuse me? Why does it do that? That's so fucking disrespectful. Whatever, get away. I don't even want you. I got what I came for, which is HP. Okay, where the hell I even am I? Okay, it looks like the north could be explored. So I might as well go for that. But before I do, I might as well hit up this zone. Alright, motherfucker. Bring it on. He summons swords. His fucking weapon does 200 damage. Okay, but they die in a single hit. Okay. Cool. Spectral Blade's attack is blocked with my shield. Okay, he only does 100 damage per swing. I think I can, I can fight this guy. Uh, that's really disrespectful of that sword to just fucking summon right behind me. Blank me. Like, what the fuck, bro? Extremely rude. I'll get a potion of greater healing. Okay, a little bit of an extreme bungle.
I defeated Spectral Knight. I received a devotional tier. That's so badass. Now I just need to not die of Amber. Okay, sweet. <laughs> Close call. You know, I think I'm going to call the episode here today. We've achieved some things. We found more victory condition zones and explored new towns. Got some devotion juice. All in all, I think it's been a very fruitful session. So, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. And I hope to see you next time for more Moonring. Goodbye!